Life is too short. We're going to have differences, but what does that matter? We're family. Despite a fan fueled social media campaign to renew the series, One Day at a Time is coming to an end on Netflix. The streaming giant has canceled the critically praised reboot of the Norman Lear comedy after three seasons. Netflix chief content officer Ted Sarandos released a rare cancellation statement. He said, in part, This was a very difficult decision, and we're thankful to all the fans who've supported the series, our partners at Sony, and all the critics who embraced it. While it's disappointing that more viewers didn't discover One Day at a Time, I believe the series will stand the test of time. You don't have to be a superwoman. There can only be one such woman in a family, and that is me. Producer Sony Pictures Television declined comment. Sources say the indie studio plans to shop the series, which could be problematic, as Netflix owns and will continue to house the first three seasons. So a library deal would help make finding the show a new home an easier task. The news follows the series' February 8th season three debut on Netflix. Stars include Justina Machado and the legendary Rita Moreno, among others. <laughs> I don't know how, but I'm sure this is my fault. <laughs> Executive producers and co-creators Mike Royce and Gloria Calderon Kellett addressed the cancellation in a heartfelt statement on Twitter. They said, in part, We've worked on many shows, but never have we experienced the outpouring of love, connection, and support like we have with One Day at a Time. Likely factoring into Netflix's decision to cancel the reboot of Lear's classic 1970s comedy was the fact that the show was owned by Sony Pictures Television, meaning that Netflix had to pay a licensing fee to run the show. Following the series' cancellation, fans are rallying to save it on Twitter using hashtag SaveODAAT. For more on this story, head to THR.com. Until next time, for The Hollywood Reporter News, I'm Tiffany Taylor.